I've added a little shadow around all these different pieces on um, papers and kind of made them pop out. Now what I'm going to do is I added that dark and now I'm going to play with a little bit of light. I have some Conti crayons here which are um, like pastels. Um, I'm going to go on the one side here and just kind of bring that white back in there, the light on um, the surface. Kind of spread it around a little bit. Not exactly sure what I'm going to do here. Um, I'm feeling like I want to make another circle around here with this. Um, do I want to make it with um, the white or the black? I think I'm going to make it with the white. And so now I'm going to come around maybe a little bit too much with what's going on there. But you know what? I need to do this. I need to go and explore. You know, making that line, going around it, not sure if it's going to work anymore, work with it. Um, not with it. Now I'm just going to smudge a little bit of this chalk. And just kind of go like that. Alright. Okay. I'm going to leave that one sit like that. Well, maybe not. Maybe I'll come in here with these letters. Kind of play with the light in here. Oh, she had, whoops, there goes my finger. Well, at this point, i try a little bit of baby wipe. Just kind of pull that off. There we go. Alright. Just add a little line in there. Let's play with that. Get it to pop a little bit. Alright. Okay, what I have to do is I have to spray this with a fixative, so I'm just going to let that sit and um, until I'm ready. Um, we'll bring this one back in. As you can see, I did um, kind of darkened it um, in a lot of places and shadowed around. Um, was showing that. Now what I want to do is I want to bring some light in there. So um, I'm going to reintroduce the white and see what happens to this edge and play along with this a little bit. Right. Right. Okay. Got it on the side, putting that mark in there on top, pushing that glue back a little bit. Hmm, I got some red. Let's see what happens if I go in there and put some red around some of these squares. Just because it's calling for it. So put a red around. See what happens. Repeat the pattern, repeat the color, um, the patterns go on the squares that are there, and, um, okay, oops, that one's there, kind of crooked, this character, um, and what if we go across and put some squares over here, which are kind of in the background, barely see it, rectangles. I'm playing with that uh, horizontal and the vertical that's here. And then I'm going to take the red and I think I'm going to rub in, smear this over here a little bit. Take my hand in. Do that. Black in there. 
Why? Because I want to repeat that black that's in there. Over here. Be careful because this isn't like the crayons. The contours can really, really smear. So, okay. Darken an area here. A little bit. Even more. So. Then I'm going to take this and bring this shadow down with the Conti Cream in here a little bit more. There. Okay, I'm going to let that one sit. And now we have this one here. Um, okay, I've got the black going, that red. Hmm, what would happen? I came in with a little red in between this. here instead of underneath, just to add some interest. A little bit different. Instead of from here coming up and then this coming down. All right, and this is calling for a little deeper red. So I'm going to do that. Now I could do this with the crayons if I wanted to, but this is really nice because it's soft right on the surface. white and just play with the hint here on the surface of the edge. Let it drag over the textures that are there. Now I'm going to take my fingers and just kind of pull it down. See the line that's there? Alright. Maybe come a little bit wider in here. Ooh, I got a little bit of wash my fingers here. Nice little baby wipe. Clean it off. Dry it. Pull from there. Okay. And then I'm going to pull and go all the way across the way the light's hitting. Just from the windows here, it's just picking up that. So I'm going to go with it. I'm just going to lighten it up a bit. All right. Ask me what I'm doing. I'm just intuitively just playing with it. I like that. Okay. Now I think I'm gonna come in here with a little dark hole in here. Just Play with that section because I've seen it come in dark. Get it to pull out from there. Okay. There's the dogs again. Always something going on in the neighborhood here. Hmm. I don't know what that was about. Kind of blend that in a bit. Okay, I'm going to stop there and I'm going to spray these.